say tap tap send say for sad the railway and my one customers need it to any one one or what you can say Obet me a creative with tap tap send wallet no e wo app no eso. Se e koba ne se tap tap rate ne ekwashra. Obet me a savings ska a kudu impenpen so bi to say fifty thousand Ghana cedis. Ane fifty thousand Ghana cedis. Na afei wo yin kakran kakran. Se o ba on my Ghana mo a. Obet me a savings ska e wo tap tap send wallet no so. Abra unya o how be ya. Na tiye. Tap tap send a trail on my shimu, a kodru UAE, Netherlands, and Austria. Tap tap send a na, a easy, fast, and a secure. Tap tap send, papa no no. Everybody check now. Check it. Fa check it. Fa check it. Check it. The beat is real. Don't we make it kill ya? Yeah. Get your green cell crocometer and check it. Sugar level, check it, check it. Fa check it, check it. Fa check it, fa check it, check it, check it. Green cell crocometer, check it. Fa check it, check it, check it. Who sugar level? Fa check it, fa check it, check it, check it. Fa check it, fa check it, check it, check it. Green cell crocometer. Everybody check now. This advert has been vetted and approved by the FDA. Special Vows Day edition here on Samiflex TV, Showbiz Daily, and we are doing the Valentine's Day edition here on the show. That's why I'm in my this red or wine or something like that. Uh, cried red room. So I'm spotting my red. Uh, it means that I have chocolate more. These people they don't have chocolate, so they are not enjoying the Vows Day edition as well. But we still have to do the work of God. Despite the fact that others are celebrating, they are lovishating and all those things, we have to come here and do the work of God. Reason in Tim Dodo Solomon Chemo is already seated at the extreme end and Roland Amate also seated in the middle for us to do the business of talking show business. Now, in doing this, I have some interesting information that I want to share with you even to start with. Today, everybody is sending something to a loved one what have you also sent to someone <laughs> Ru, what have you sent to someone uh, I've, I've not sent anything to it yeah i have why it means what you don't have any loved one or what? oh it is not as if i don't have any uh -huh. loved one but uh -huh. um uh, well i am i am not someone who is so moved by some of these occasional days no, and I said, me, I guess I mean, I mean, yeah, but uh -huh. the way people put certain premium on it, say, as in say, if you say, we are a name, then it has some higher value. You know, that is what me I don't see because I would prefer say, out of the blue, somebody would say, okay, mm. I, I am gifting you this, I am checking up on you, I'm doing mm. this, I'm doing that. That one even goes off the normal seasonal stuff, say, okay. Out of the blue, the person still thinks about you. Mm. That is me. What moves me more mm. than some of these occasional stuff. But mm. then, if occasionally it falls inside or it falls within the fact that okay, I would want to show somebody love. Why not? Mm. I would definitely do it. But today's activities, there. Uh, so you had some people that you were supposed to. But yes, because uh, yeah. you are not moved. And, uh, and also, the system is hot. <laughs> so. <laughs> as you, <laughs> Maybe we have to sell the scrap of the aviation industry. <laughs> <laughs> so that you have to kill the aviation yes, industry yes, to do yes, something. Yes, yes, we will sell the mm -hmm. the, the plastic 
plain uh-huh. as a, a restaurant <laughs> so that we can get money to and then later you say yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so you use money to do uh, I don't know I yeah. was here and my <laughs> sent me a message Emily yeah. Yeah. that is what have you what I what have you bought for mommy I said hey 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 Charlie. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But sometimes some of these things are uh, unnecessary pressure. Ah, oh. ah. Oh. 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 That means you don't you, you don't care. You don't I, I saw that Re- Regina Daniels. Mm-hmm. Your tall Lexus, brand new, mm-hmm. it's a bulletproof Lexus. Yeah. Exactly. And their manu. So this on one Val's day. All the girls on social media ah. friends can't afford some of these things. Yeah, the red ribbons are born with no name now. What your picture is here? And and you know, to the girls, it is like a competition. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't get out. <laughs> it is a competition. Um, happy Val's day to everybody. Yeah. In fact, yeah. if you are special, you are special. Mm-hmm. Yes. We are special in different ways. Of so if course. you are special, don't wait till only today. No, to the to, uh, you better to the glam. Uh, don't do it to the, the glam, glam before you see that uh, you are special. You just have to do what uh, you are doing and you are good. Now let's get into other serious matters as well. Today, Operation Save Ghana football demonstration happened. Thanks to countryman Songo and his people, they hit the streets. They got permission from Ghana police and hey, the number of police officers I saw. Wow, that was crazy. And I would want to ask my people that some of these things, will these things lead us to the solution? Or there's also another talk show by some people to just make their name and that will be all. Digital Rasta Currency is handling our camera for us on this show. Um, Richie Flex is the editor director of the show. Tap Tap Send is also holding us down. If you are watching us and you want to be sending money from abroad to Ghana, remember to always get Tap Tap Send. It's an app. Download it on your phone today and start using their wallet. Their wallet will help you to even save some more money at a higher exchange rate. What you have to do is to change the money when the exchange is high. Put the money in your wallet and anytime you want to send it back home, you get the best of value that you can ever get. Do it today. Use the promo code SAMIFLEX and thank me later. Operation Save Ghana Football Protests. Is this the way to our solution? Maybe Chemo, I'll start this with you. Yeah. Um, Rich, you can show us some of the videos and uh, uh, photos if necessary. Mm -hmm. Nothing will really change. Nothing. No matter what. I don't see anything change. What do you mean? Um, Are you trying to say that in Ghana we are not sensible enough or what how come nothing how can nothing like how come nothing will change well for the people with all the talking left right and center yeah so we can it will only only be a moral issue for the football people Mm -hmm. what i'm saying is that for the football people you can't do much it's like this is how we want to run it okay if you think we are not doing it right my people will judge me they Mm -hmm. will vote at the end of the day Mm -hmm. every four years they go for their congress and then they vote for uh, who who's supposed to lead them as in gfa the ghana football association mm-hmm. it is an association it's not a private organization it's not a public institution it's mm-hmm. a private organization mm. uh, being managed by football people like okay. if you have a team or you work with any team in ghana mm-hmm. you have a vote there Mm. So you vote for who the person to lead, mm-hmm. and for them, some of this thing may not do anything to them because whatever that they do, you can't judge them by just talking. Mm-hmm. So that's why I'm saying that for football people, this thing may not change much unless well their conscience will tell them, Charlie, people are not happy with us. Let let us do something. Okay. so that people will be okay mm-hmm. so there's no much that you can do when it comes to football people the mm-hmm. gfa in particular mm-hmm. but politically we can do something mm-hmm. the politicians may see this as an advantage to do something for people to vote for them okay so politically we may see something happening i mean they can decide not to support the gfa the way they do mm-hmm. so that people will be happy and then they may if they are the ones giving the uh, FA money to do certain things, then they can tell the FA, me too, I want people to vote for me. Mm-hmm. So if I have to give you money, then you too, you should do something for me to tell my people. 
Okay. That's where the changes may come. That's why I'm saying that, yes, what they have done now, all eyes on you kind of thing. It's like, whatever that you do, people are now watching you. Mm -hmm. What can I do for them to come down and say that, oh, something good is coming. So let's work together and make it happen. Okay. So between the politicians and then the football people, as in, in the case of the GFA, mm -hmm. that is where we will see any if there will be a change or not. In fact, this demonstration that they did, they didn't go to the GFA. They went to the politicians. Okay. They submitted the petition to to the politicians. To the politicians, the Ministry of uh, Sports. Sports. Okay. So the FA people, they are just they are still corner, there, uh -huh, watching what is happening. The, if we want to make a drastic decision, it's like we we can just dissolve it. Mm -hmm. But if we do that, it means we are no more with the FIFA. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, according to FIFA's regulation, you can't interfere with the FA. Okay. You can't interfere there if you are a, a government or a politician. If you interfere with it, they will sanction us from being a part of the World Football Association, which means we can't participate in any tournament, we can't participate in anything FIFA. Okay. So that's why we cannot shake much if the GFA decide to do their own thing mm. as they've been doing. Mm. But the politicians can do something as in we won't support you if you don't listen to us. Okay. Be people are not happy. So me, I, I, I hope that the politicians will rather have change of mind. And if they don't, if they want to win power, these are some of the ways because a lot of people in Ghana here love football. Okay. And look at a number of people who went there huge number mm -hmm. they were really like it was massive i i watched uh, joy news and i saw the numbers a lot of people went there so any politicians politician who wants to win power i think this is a way to do something especially if you are in power as we are talking i mean there's an uh, a way for you to sit down with the fa mm -hmm. and tell them that Charlie, my people are not happy mm -hmm. what can we do to make things better Okay. And then we just take that path that something will change. Because based on what is happening, yes, this is what we can do, save our football. Okay. Because nothing good is happening here. But I think the problem goes beyond the even the FA's decision and what they are doing. Mm -hmm. We are in an economy that is so hard that any footballer in Ghana here who is showing potential, not like he's good, mm -hmm. showing that he can be good, he will go to uh, uh, Libya to mm -hmm. play Libyan League mm -hmm. so that he will get a better pay. Because if you are playing in, even in Kotoko or Haas, I think, well, if I'm not mistaken, the highest paid player will take, let's say, 10,000. Mm -hmm. And you will not get five people taking 10,000. Mm -hmm. Most most of them will be taking around 1,500 to 2,000 cities. And as a footballer, with all the eyes on you, getting popularity and all that, taking 2,000 cities a month in Ghana here will be nothing. Yeah. It's just a little over uh, $100, mm -hmm. let's say $200 mm -hmm. a month. Mm -hmm. A footballer, mm -hmm. with all the names and the accolades, taking $200 a month, no you will not take it so you would rather go to libya or you will go to uh, iraq and mm -hmm. take 500 or thousand dollars a month Kazakhstan. so the problem goes beyond even the fa i think we should do something about the economy okay. and then again the fa should also instead of use uh, Using money to take care of themselves, like if they go for a meeting, they will take hundred dollar, hundred thousand dollar each. Mm -hmm. They can loan it to the teams, mm -hmm. and then for them to pay their players well, so that some of them will stay longer. When they go outside, the money that they get, they pay back the loan or something instead of using the money and share it among yourself. So I think the FA they have a part to play. Politicians have also their part to play. But in this case, the demonstration, the effect that it may get will come from the politician, not the football people. The For football. them, I don't have any hope. I see. Ro, um, how do you also see this ending or how, where do you see it going? Yeah, right, I mean, at least um, it is going to shake certain tables a bit. Mm -hmm. But as to whether there is going to be a complete U-turn 
or a sudden U turn of the way things are going is also a different conversation. Okay. Of which some of us do not even have the hope in mm -hmm. that it is going to happen that way. Okay. But then I, I would still have wished that aside petitioning the politicians, that is the Ministry of Youth and Sports as well as the president himself, they they should also bank this as well at the doorstep of the FA directly because mm -hmm. what they did was an indirect bank on their door mm -hmm. and they can choose to pay it to it or not okay that's that's them because besides your petition did not come to them your mm -hmm. petition went to a different court there's probably you think have higher authority over them but hey they are autonomous mm -hmm. whatever they would want to do is what they would do mm -hmm. the moment the people that you are petitioning try to interfere in their operations they will just lift their hands and say, FIFA, this is what is going on. It is better you take you take us out of whatever you're doing, of your association, and that's all. And mm -hmm. you just be kicked out like that. Mm -hmm. So um, I would wish that they should also petition, they, they should have also petitioned the FA bosses, because at the end of the day, the people that are going to elect the FA boss that they are crying over is their own people. Mm -hmm. And it's nobody out of any fraternity would go into the football fraternity to go and vote for Ketu mm -hmm. It is they themselves that will vote for them. So if you want a change in that space, I believe that change should be, or that particular question should be also within that quarters. Okay. But when you bypass them simply because, okay, you think it is the government that is funding most of their operations and all that. At the end of the day, whatever they will, they would want to do, they will still do it. Whether the government comes in to support them or not. Yes, if the government stops supporting them, it will have an effect on them in in a way. Mm -hmm. But with the way they operate, there is no they have a way of luring the government into their dealings each and every time. Okay. Of which they give them reasons beyond what you are saying, mm -hmm. which is why they are getting them. Mm -hmm. so if you also don't go and bang at their door for them to know that whatever they are doing you see it directly and you can equally come at them like the way you are going at the politicians because if the politicians go at the football association that is where it will be sanctioned but if the people themselves go against the association there's nothing anybody can do they would know that yes they are messing up and whatever they are doing is having an effect on on the country okay. mm -hmm. let, let me give this information okay I, according to the story that i watched mm -hmm. they said that initial plan was to go to the fa but mm -hmm. the police uh, advised against that okay that they know they shouldn't go to the fa they should rather go to the uh, uh, the, the parliament house to meet the minister so i think they will copy the fa okay that's what i'm thinking yeah. mm. whatever that they will send to the ministry by all means they will give a copy to the, to the FA. yeah of course so, okay. so that they would know directly that whatever they are doing they can equally come at them so today probably today might be maybe the starting of a new dawn for them to know this is m most uh how do we call it the first of uh, uh, a demonstration that is against the football uh, the football people mm -hmm. so at least this is just an opening so next time should even the government try to do certain things well and you still be you still continue to do the things you're doing as a football association then the next demonstration will not go to the government again will come straight at your doorstep mm -hmm. it will be targeted at you solely and that one day you will feel it because whether you are the ones that are going to elect your own people or not you should know that whatever you do on a larger scale also comes to have an effect on on what you do i mean i i don't understand how a management committee member would be taking a hundred thousand dollars while somebody a, a league a team a premier league team plays over 38 matches and takes thirty thousand dollars when they win the league it doesn't make sense in any way mm. meanwhile when the league goes sponsorship less and uh, without a sponsor and they would want to and they they the the team starts crying they would the fa would tell them oh we are now going to look for sponsors so you wait how meanwhile these these monies are, st are still monies it uh, have been allocated to the association because they have bodies that they are operating or they they, they come together as a collective 
So okay. if they come together as a collective and it is on their behalf, you are taking those monies from FIFA, then why shouldn't they be the beneficiaries of some of these things? And the Ministry of Sports too, I think it is about time they set up. Because yes, as much as we would want to blame Keto Kriku and his people for some of these poor decisions, I tell you, most of their decisions are only based and affect only football. And when you check sports in general in the country, it goes beyond football. If the Ministry of Sports says, okay, this time I want us to also focus on other sports because football has enough funding from FIFA, we would get, the, that is when they will feel the competition. Now, if they are doing something, they would make sure that they, they still maintain football as the number one sport in the country. When they know that, okay, they now have um, a basketball team that is also winning laurels to the country and people are focusing their energy towards that side. It will give them competition, but now football has no competition in the country, so they would want to do anything that they like. So, yes, I would commend the people that champion this course, mm. and I, I, will, I will pat them in the back and say kudos. But we, we wish that. It, we don't know it whether... Brings the results. Yes, we don't know whether results. it will bring the result, but we wish... Okay. that it will bring the results that we all need well still on football let's go to nigeria and um after placing second in the just ended afcon we are hearing something beautiful from nigeria that we cannot keep quiet about of course we've trolled them enough after they are lost to ivory coast and the rest that we are hearing needs to be commended and i want to also read to my people then we listen to what they are saying. So in the picture, uh, you can see Nigeria's president and their vice. The vice was at um, Ivory Coast over the weekend, uh, where he was part of the dignitaries who presented the medals. Yes, the medals and the trophies to the winners, the second place as well. And uh, Richie, I don't know if you want me to read from what you have. Um, so uh, should I read from here or there is some up there? Okay, so it says, President H.E., His Excellency Bola Ahmed Tinibu has awarded the Super Eagles for finishing as runners-up at the AFCON 2023. Every member of the Nigerian squad will receive member of the Order of Nigeria, that is a national award, flats in the federal capital territory and pieces of land. All these things the government of or the state of nigeria is doing this for them and uh, this is different from what they are going to get from the football itself they play though um the, the second place goes home with how much four million four million dollars mm. <laughs> <laughs> cash cash yeah. four million dollars for about 20 something people and alongside they've been given oh it will go to the fa so the fa will decide how do you oh, got, got chop and pepper <laughs> <laughs> so the family there to finish <laughs> <laughs> you will the, chop and pepper chop and no 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 we for chop the place so you can figure some chop uh -huh. if you don't chop the place so, so, uh -huh. so, uh -huh. so away from the coefficient <laughs> sharing, this is what the government of nigeria is doing for the place and i'm asking wow then it means if they had won in Ghana, we chop the money before we go for <laughs> we go for the tournament. Like this thing, I'm sure like but I can make chamo master. So anybody can make chamo bumba bumbuji. Now send a bumba phone when you're back. Could be me in the video. Chamo, what do we say about this? Yeah, is it is, worth commending? It, yes, it's it's positive. Uh, it's positive. I think if our people will learn anything, uh, this is how it should be. Mm -hmm. I mean, we can even promise them if you win the cup or if you go closer to the cup, if you get closer to the cup, mm -hmm. we can do some of this thing for you. Okay. Uh, if you start with this one, I think there's no sense of agency anymore. Like the way they give them money before we even start the tournament. Mm -hmm. I mean, what are they fighting for again? Mm -hmm. they, 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 they are sorted. So I think this is good and others can learn from it. If they are doing well, you reward them. Okay. If they are not doing well, to you tell them that no, it's not going well. Okay. So to sit up. Mm. So I think uh, the uh, government, Nigerian uh, government, I think they have done well. Okay. And uh, this will motivate the players. I mm. mean, I know that some people will bash them anyway. Mm -hmm. They will get some insult and all that. But yes, that's football for you. It's okay. not everybody who will be happy 
that you, you couldn't win. Yes, some people are still angry that you couldn't take the cup, especially the mistakes that came in. Okay. Those people, they'll be in trouble mm. for a mm. while mm. before it gets better. Fact. But now getting this, I mean, now you know your your works that you did, it, it is paying off. Okay. And, and yes, we have to commend the, the official, the government for, mm -hmm. for doing some of this thing for them. Mm. And they are doing it in a way that it will also keep them there. I mean, they are giving them lands that they can build on it, okay. which means they will stay there. Okay. And then the other things that is going with it, I think it's a good thing and others should learn from it. Yeah. Well, Ro, Nigerian players and the benefits um, they are going to enjoy after placing second um in the afcon uh, you know you know what just came to mind i remember when i think the ghana played second or third when they were giving the grand cherokee mm -hmm. yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, there, there was yeah. third eh? second second when could it be on penalties, penalties yes mm -hmm. you see it's it's similar to what they they have achieved mm -hmm. uh, but then for for how far for how passionate Ghana is about football and how we've invested in in our football in or in this Black Stars setup, I I wish that we would not even give them anything. Now the promise should not even come before. It should be when you win the cup, then this is what you get, mm -hmm. kinda. Because if if there is no motivation, let's check all the teams or the setups that have won anything substantial for for or anything of importance for the country it has always the motivation has always been from a different angle mm -hmm. either from hunger or from the fact that okay when we win some people i i remember one of the black queens captains said that oh she she really wants to win one tournament because she would get the opportunity to meet the president mm. Mm, mm, and that's how she yes, wanted to do it. Yes, and that's that's the reason why she wanted to at least get to an appreciable position in during the tournament. And mm -hmm. you see some of these things. Yes, you you may say, oh, then how about the guys that at least she she can also be given money and all that. Yes, it is there. But let's let's allow them to hunger from a different side rather than us stuffing them with money or gift before the tournament mm -hmm. with that there is no motivation anywhere okay these nigerian boys it is not as if they don't have their own monies i mean these are big boys that are playing in some of the big clubs in europe and are taking their monies already mm -hmm. but the hunger did not come from the money the hunger did not come from the fact that we were even promised some of these things but it came from the fact that okay we have a task ahead we've been there we've tried on countless occasions to get to a certain level and we've still not been able to achieve i mean the best that ghana has ever come for uh, for over uh, i mean in the last decade has to do with we being in the finals and being beaten mm -hmm. so what next what next do we pick a coach and say go and do well as your task mm. it doesn't make sense mm. the last time the fa held a, a press conference they were saying no now when ghana is in any tournament then the fans are expecting ghana to win like what should we expect mm -hmm. what should we expect when you are pumping the nation's money into this into into the setup and also you've been there before it is not as if you've not been there you've been there before so it means it can be done again mm -hmm. it can be done again then you come and say oh they, they are expecting now what what should we we should just go and participate because because what we don't we don't know what you use our love and passion for <laughs> so they they pick a coach and it is go and do well go and do well then they chop them then they chop them <laughs> if it is go and do well if it is go and do well then the 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 tag of giving ghana uh, the tag football nation football nation should be taken off mm. because we are just participants like the other teams that come and they take four they take three they take two then they go out Mm -hmm. Because we never even had a chance to qualify from the good state. We didn't win any match. Mm -hmm. And we just left uh, woefully like that. So for the Nigerians there, we, we will just congratulate them. Just that we are still happy they didn't win the cup. Uh -huh. <laughs> that one day we are still happy. But for this one, we but still... The things they are enjoying... Oh, yes. Uh, oh, it, they, oh it, they deserve it. Okay. They deserve it. At least 
upon the throws and everything that they got on the final day this one can ease their pain they mm -hmm. deserve it yes but the cap they we are happy they did not equal Ghana's four until we move to five then they can come to four mm, campaign message <laughs> <laughs> this is a call campaign message well let's come back to ghana after nigeria let's come mm. back to ghana and veteran rapper musician Ochiame Kwame has been preaching his new philosophies there is one that i've compiled from an interview he granted to abeku santana on okay fm and i would want us to watch and react to some of the issues he raised one was the fact that he thinks wearing the boxer shorts and those things were no issues again he says uh, despite what he's been able to achieve as a rapper he does not want to compare himself to some of the new rappers today as in to him he thinks they are doing better than he has been doing or he did and more i would want us to watch and when i come i get a reaction of my people to this video from okfm let's watch it i'll be back so parts that will be called that we're cheating all right but on cheating on you we're cheating on so parts that will be called that we're cheating all right but on cheating on you we're cheating on on one home okay my mom remove a yeah a sephata sebema edini tedia ebe she tedia boha koto ku a na ma fo fo na box action ni be come for ni e dey have to aman sai abel fontin so parts that will be called that we cheating all right but on cheating on you we cheating on on one home okay mama mremu no eye e sefata sebema edini tedia ebe she tedia boha koto ku a na ma fo fo na box action ni be come for ni e dey have to aman sai abel fontin time home internet so say ya no fo nyina obi am hwe bi sa na obi so obisa we no girl na obisa say sa na tia na See, see a boxer shorts in it. And show be a still. Eh, hmm. And see, I don't be wear a tree. You should have the perforated cotton. I share a tree. So, the baby, I didn't bet me a home. It is a cotton and a show in a chair. So, what's that? Now, I'm not going to buy it. 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 Because, I'm not going to buy it. Say, me hear him burning up a palm tree. I'm the one in the China. We are going to hear headline. Me hear him burning up a palm tree. No more. Yeah, a palm tree. I'm the China. Ma, what you say? I'm not saying. I'm not per click bait. It was not per se. I'm not trying to say. I'm not saying. Baby, say the baby. Anya ni pa burning say. I'm not here. My ham you. Name um. I'm not here. Say the baby. I'm not. Kofu ba be kai say. Blogger senior di. I'm not. Ye fa wedi me ma. I say kofu. We need traction. A certain amount in a month. Yes, I be you ready. Intimate di. I'm not here. Nasa. But I said, "Me Did you say that? Me, me kasa debi a me sample space ya one me. Me a mitina we. Me then na me de me huwa compare rap a bit to say I'm rado. Ana se lyrical Joe. Ana se me a me a flow king stone. Ana se inspiration from you no. Are you saying say they are better than you? Eh, abe. Say me me a mo ti hey. If by the time I'm here twenty two, no moon ain't me ni ni oma me ain't me ni ebi da. Not just a failure. Evolution concept, you know, is to make sure but that artists, younger ones are but better. There are artists who have said on various platforms that they took inspiration from you. You inspired them. You mentored them. They copied you. They learned from you. And how can you say that those who copied you are better than you? Abe, because it is the truth. Won't you hear rap that? Kope hear when you na bonnet tie me di na na me hear in ninety seven no. Ube who say e similar. But back only a modern, back only a more intricate. It was a certain energy. It's an add on to the main my you know. And it's a one young to say new generation now everybody is better than you are. Not just a one year real. Well, I told you that the man has been talking. He has been preaching. One of the things that has been in my mind and i've been thinking about often is the fact that a chamber kwame says if your partner cheats on no okay not cheat cry if your partner goes to have an affair with another person he's not cheated on you mm. it is he himself that has cheated mm. on himself therefore you don't even have to be bothered but if he comes to apologize forgive forget and even love them more mm. 
because he came to apologize. But I'm going to call me husband talk. Bro. Yeah, friend Edwin Derry. Area Bro, what is your reaction to some of what Chamber Kwame's philosophies? Latest philosophies. Well, it is just like motivational messages. Mm -hmm. Some of them, some people would understand and pick. Some of them, well, it is not applicable to everybody. For for the one that he's saying, okay, if you are with your partner and he he or she goes to sleep with another person, he's not cheated on you, but cheated on him or herself. I think it is subjective because every relationship has its own set of rules. Mm -hmm. Yes. So if you and your partner agree that, oh, this relationship there, it is open for all. You can go here, you can go there. Then I can say nobody is cheating anybody. Mm -hmm. And if it is also marriage, then I can say if, if it is marriage and you guys have agreed between the two of you that it is only the two of us that are going to do this thing and the person goes to do it with another person, of course, it is cheating. Mm. In that sense, mm. it is cheating. What about two one? What I say because we get near one on one two. Mm -hmm. So it, that in that sense, it is cheating. Mm. But then the other one that he also raised with the rapping and the fact that the younger generations are better than him. I think in a certain context, I would agree okay. that yes, sometimes the younger generations are better than the older generations, and it okay. is because if and it, it has its own parameters that is if you assess and with the things that the younger the person the younger generation has the products that they've churned out is better than yours mm. or is more successful than yours mm. then that is it it is like it is just like a teacher teaching a student the teacher teaches the student for the student to be better than him mm -hmm. that is it mm. so moving forward the student would have certain things that the teacher did not get during his time Mm. And it can make the students better than the teacher. So many people. I'm go still thinking about whether teachers teach us to be better than them. I'm still. Oh, thinking that about one there. <laughs> that one there is is, is true. That That's I'm, I'm I'm still yes. thinking and asking like, do mm. they really want us better than them? Oh, whether they like it or not. That's <laughs> that is the that is the end. That is how the end result is supposed to be. Okay. That's how the end result because if a teacher teaches you in let's say primary JHS and SHS, mm -hmm. and you would want to be a doctor. And, but the teacher can also teach you science. But the teacher is not a qualified doctor. Mm -hmm. In that sense, you would be a better scientist than the teacher who okay. probably taught you science in school. Okay. And that will make you better. you be a better teacher than him? Because you are comparing different things here. Okay. If it is in that line, why not? I am talking science. Mm -hmm. If we have people, if we want people to explain science to the core, and a teacher has taught you in JHS, and you are a doctor, and we want somebody to explain science in that matter. They would not go and call the teacher, no matter his level. They would go and call the doctor for him to come and explain. Because mm -hmm. people would think that, okay, he has advanced knowledge in, in that particular field than the teacher. In okay. that sense. Mm. That's, that, so with that, I can agree to him to some extent. But then, there are certain youngsters or people who find themselves in a younger generation whose work is no near even the people in the older generation, even with their limited resources that they even had in the past. Okay. In that sense, you can't do that comparison. Okay. Because there are certain youngsters that are being compared that, oh, you are better than this person, you are better than that person. But when you check, even with the things, the incentives that they even have to their disposal now, and what they are even doing, they, they, the things that they've even done do not even come close to, to the Lumbes or to the Nane Champon or even to the probable them scra they mm -hmm. don't even come close mm. so in that sense you can't compare but when you assess the person and you realize that charlie yes maradona came won so many laurels and, yeah. and all that but when you look at the things that Messi have come to do you you can't you can clearly say that okay Messi has become a better player than maradona in that sense you you can make that comparison but when you check neymar and you take maradona and you check what Neymar has done. It doesn't come anywhere close to what Maradona achieved in his career. Okay. In that sense, you can't compare. But for the cheating there, I think what Chame Kwame is preaching. And in mm. preaching, there are certain things that you would say that can go off. Mm. In preaching, there are certain things you say 
it, that can go up, like motivational message, mm-hmm. messages. Mm-hmm. I started my portrait farm with two files, mm-hmm. one male, one female, and they <laughs> cross and now I own a portrait farm. Uh-huh. Yes, it can only be applicable, it is subjective. Uh-huh. So if you watch your space and you can apply it and it will be good for you, why not? If your partner goes to, to sleep with another person and you, Usha was sitting in and you would want to accept the person, and be another new partner or help. I will put you on pen, on pen. I will put you on proper level. You definitely agree. <laughs> you definitely agree. Well, 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 well. Friends, I'm happy. Oh yeah, sorry, you cry. I can, I can, I can't, I can't just so good cheat ya. Oh my God, so Janet, Janet, I'm coming now. You understand? In that level, you agree. So me, I partly agree with some of the things, but some of the things so they're off, mommy. Well, Jamu. A chairman Kwame has been preaching still. Yeah. I think some of the issue you 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 listen to the first word like or the first sentence will be like the headline. Mm-hmm. And then what he will say after the headline will, 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 will throw you off. Match, yes, or not match the things that he say. Some of them it is generally true, but the one you want to go for specifics, you can't apply it. Like him saying that uh, the cheating thing. First of all, mm-hmm. a woman cheating and a man cheating is not the same thing. Mm-hmm. It's two different things. The way women are wired and the way men are wired are different. So you can't generalize it. If a man cheats, it's less of an issue than if a woman cheats. Mm. So you can't even generalize and say it. It will be easy for a woman to forgive a man cheating than a man forgive a woman cheating. Mm. And the, and the reason is simple. Before a woman will allow another person to sleep with with her, there are a lot of factors that that woman will consider. consider yeah. And they rank men in order of uh, competence before they will allow you to sleep with you. So if a woman allows the highest man, the competence as you can get to sleep with her, and then allows the lowest in terms of competence to sleep with her, that woman has no value. The man with the less competence should aspire to get there. And it shouldn't be that easy. It's either he's competing with that highest competent man or to some extent, to a level that the woman will say, okay, you are among the pool that I want. So any woman just allowing anybody at all to sleep with her, she, she's of no value. Mm-hmm. So you can't use that if that a, a woman like that, you say that if she comes, she's cheating herself, you should accept. No. As a man, your value will go down if they see you with a woman with low value. That's how it works. Mm-hmm. So you can't just generalize and say it uh, with Ochamis caliber. And how people see him in the society. If a woman cheats with a lower man, a man that we see that he's nowhere near Ochami's uh, uh, status, Ochami will lose respect. Mm-hmm. People will not respect him. Mm. It will not be about the woman cheating. It will be about how you couldn't maintain a woman like that for that woman to go for a low class person. Mm. In terms of uh, social status, yeah, I'm not saying that people are nobody. I know when you talk like this, people mm-hmm. that yeah. start picking yeah. on it. Yeah. So you mean we, mm-hmm. we are all human beings, but in every society, some are human beings more yes, than others. Oh, yeah, yeah. There is a class. <laughs> like, I said that's by tragic oh, oh, again. Yes, mm-hmm. automatically we have rank <laughs> ourselves in our own way. Mm-hmm. So based on who is cheating and how the cheating is done, we we'll determine whether you have to forgive the person or not. So what I mean, generalizing it is, is, is a big problem for me. If he can explain that, okay, if a person like this cheats, then you can forgive, like mm-hmm. uh, uh, Roland jokingly saying, mm-hmm. if uh, you are a broker kind of person, <laughs> mm-hmm. and then uh, a fear, a fear is cheating on you, what do you have? You don't have any logic. <laughs> 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 you see, the same thing with the women. There are some men that they will cheat on you and go like, I will lose if I decide to let this man go. So mm-hmm. you accept it. Mm. Instead of letting that man go. That's how it works. So him generalizing it, I, I disagree with him. But if he was specific and say, a man like this can cheat or a woman like this can cheat, 
then I will be in the same page mm. with him because it's it's not a general thing. You can't go like that. Mm. And uh, and with his uh, rap thing, being some uh, new generation should be. I think he is using the should to mean that they should be better than him. Than him. But that's not the case. Are they better than you now? You have to uh, compare records. Mm -hmm. Instead of you trying to make it look like the Since fact that they, they are, are now, doing, now it. doing it, they should be better than you. No, it doesn't work like that. It should be specific here. The uh, the rappers that he mentions, for me, none of them is better than him. They are not there yet. Mm. They can be better than him with time. Mm. Or they should be better than him because of the resources they have now okay. and the things that they are doing now. Okay. But they, let's compare their records now to your records. Mm -hmm. They come nowhere close. Mm. The kind of hit song that you got, the kind of money that you made at that time, the kind of even awards that you got, they are nowhere close. Mm -hmm. So how can you say that they are better than you? Mm. What are you using to mm. make Measure. such a decision? Yeah. They should be better than you, yes. Mm. But we are not talking about shoe here. If we are comparing what the current situation. So I think that one too, he used uh, what should happen instead of telling what is this now comparatively like what are they doing now that you think that they are better than you or now like currently what you are doing they are better than you because you are not into it that much like the way they are they are doing other things that you are not aware or you can't keep up because of modern technology like explain it in a way for us to say oh okay you have a point because you are not as active as they are now. Mm -hmm. They are now doing something that you can't do now because of technology difference or whatever. So in that sense, if you say they are better than you, then we can come with you and say, oh, okay, you have a point here. But when you, in general, what you have done and what they have done now, I, I will have a different opinion if you say that. I get it. I will have a different opinion. So I think... <coughs> Some of the things that he's saying is more like he we know how the end should be, then he will make it look like this is how it is, and and I think he should come again with some of these things because people will pick it and then run with it as he said. Sometimes that's not what you want. You to want see. it to be yeah. yes, but you know the click people will use it for something else. So uh, for that matter, I think. He should be clear and be specific about things that he says instead of generalizing it, generalizing it yeah. in a way that people can just uh, take any meaning that they want and then run add it with to it. it. Yeah, yes. yeah. I think he should. He should well, he should um, the gospel according to Ochiame Kwame. For some mm -hmm. time now, the um, I think our man has been really preaching his philosophies and we have to either learn or ignore that is all that i can say you either learn the philosophies of chami kwame is preaching or you have to ignore them now finally let's go to achimota market um earlier today at achimota market um shatawale's girlfriend mali and the team from uh, Roadmasters Delivery, Shagzi, as well as Shatter Movement Empire were there at Achimota Market to donate uh, to the women who have supported a young man called Kweku Dubai. If you have been watching this channel religiously, you might have chanced on an interview of a young man called Kweku Dubai who has been mobilizing market women in Achimota Market to publicize or promote some of Shatawale's works and because they've been doing this over the months and Shatawale's team feels it is time for us to appreciate them um, the girlfriend Mali and other staff members from um, 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 Roadmasters Delivery where she is the boss she's actually the boss of Roadmasters Delivery they were there to support um, the team to deliver some items um, hampers chocolates and an undisclosed amount of money to Kweku Dubai and these market women and I want to ask my people uh, their reaction on this as well before we run away from here uh, Ru, you were there so I'm sure you can start talking so Chamo can steal some of your points to what he will be saying well I would say congratulations to Kweku Dubai and his people I think their hard work is finally paying off. I remember when I have, I had a one-on-one -on -one with um, his mom. His mom was say, telling me that oh now, his his recognition has grown so high that 
um, people, other people are even calling him to promote their songs and their projects and all wow. that. And it, it, feel, it feels good. So aside this particular gesture, I like the fact that, okay, he's also getting something of importance to himself and, mm -hmm. and to his name. This is also an elevation and a huge endorsement to the fact that, okay, now he is gradually going to become a brand that you can equally do business with, even in that line, even though mm. the brand is still young, these are top brands that are appreciating the boys' effort mm. and, and the women effort. And you see, when we say the creative arts, the benefit in the creative arts cut across, these are some of the things that we mean. I mean, out of the fact that some of these, these this guy and these market women are doing some of these things, just to entertain themselves the benefit is going into the market because at the end of the day if somebody even doesn't know the achimota market mm -hmm. now yeah, yeah. it will Shaking be publicized in a video. Mm -hmm. it, it will be publicized it will be publicized so well it has been publicized so well to the extent that now most of them know them and one of the women was also saying that now people actually come to say oh we who take talk anything i maybe oh, wow. toward you like they oh, wow yes they come to them to and they say, Oh, me, me a shut up movement fan. Me who will take to sell promote t-shirt and you think I may have a toy. And it feels mm. good, it feels good. And I would want to say congratulations to them. And I hope this thing will go a long way to motivate them to do more so that at least any she can we or could you not say and they know a call uncle as expected. No can important at least you've put in a smile on somebody's face and okay. it is it is a blessing to everybody who who made a part so i would say um big ups to the bosses of all the companies mm -hmm. the group of companies roadmasters mali shatawali for Sh uh, shatter movement and shatter Shatsi foundation as well and shatter foundation as well and to and to you also for for mm. leading the initiative mm. i mean this is a beautiful thing yeah. it's a beautiful thing that anybody could have said oh because of the stress and everything let's grab it but you also championed it to make mm. it happen and mm. in fact the publicity has also gone well so big ups to everybody involved okay Chemo, yeah. um we are wrapping up yeah this is beautiful mm -hmm. um i i remember I, I don't know it's been a long time by guinness they they had an advert okay and then in that advert uh, there was a dj and then the dj had an assistant mm -hmm. and they would go and play a show all the time and the assistant wanted to also play mm -hmm. so he asked the boss boss when am i going to play ah uh, yeah 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 yeah, said, yeah 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 your time will come, will come. <laughs> yeah time yeah will yeah, come. yeah. So I think, uh, it was a samini samini featured in that but eh? yeah, it's been a it's, it's, it's a, a long time but i think those who did it the that advert, they, they were, played some samini song yeah. when when yeah. the when the guy said your time, time will come, come your time will come it's your time and you have to stand uh, no that is mtn uh, that's mtn okay there was one yes your so, time will come yeah, yeah I, think, I know this had the characters yeah. i think they were uh, south, south africans yes south africans yeah beautiful uh, concept uh, yes, yeah beautiful concept and your time will come now <laughs> uh, Koku Dubai's time, time has, uh, come. It has come. Yeah. For him, uh, it's one day will come. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, Coming from mm -hmm. the song yeah. like Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. So I think this is Koku Dubai's time. So uh, after today, it will be about how he will utilize mm -hmm. the opportunity mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. the uh, fame coming. Mm -hmm. I mean, there should be a business plan to it so that he can still keep it going. Okay. So I'm I'm very happy to hear that there are other. Uh, musicians or other people who wants to uh, engage him to do stuff uh, with stuff them for them yes i think shatter has given him that shoot yeah or that value yeah for others yeah. to also approach him so mm. thank you to shatter as well mm. i think mm. even apart from this showing this kind gesture that th there's that value that now could buy also has yeah that he can also use to do business fact yeah. fact so it's, it's a good one and i think the market women today will be very happy very happy but yes i wasn't there but i can imagine that they were really really happy to also receive such kind gesture mm -hmm. and then the timing was also right mm -hmm. i mean whoever said that we, let's do it at this on time. Vows day yeah you, yeah the person got it right yeah yes on mm. Vows day showing mm. love like this coming from shatawali is mm -hmm. this like you can't get it better than this mm. this is mm. this mm. is the ultimate and 
again the delivery what's the name of road the master's road delivery. delivery yeah and the road master's delivery too i think they did well and the whole ceo was there mm. that one too is positive mm. i think mm. yes mm. and and they were in the market yeah like business can come from there as well yeah. i mean road uh, master's delivery, delivery. Mm. can also be delivering uh, food items to tomatoes and to things sales to <laughs> people and all that. so it's, it's positive i think today it, it, it's a good day for mm -hmm. Baku Dubai and, mm -hmm. and the market women. Mm -hmm. And in fact, for anybody who took part of it and you also shared things to them, I think this is positive and we should encourage people to think like this and, and then do something like that. It, it will help everybody. Mm. The, I think the Shata brand will also get some form of respect for doing things like this. Fact. The same way Baku Dubai and uh, the market women will also get appreciation from doing something like it. so this is this is beautiful okay yeah. now let, let me ask this question to you too so we wrap up um whilst we were there i heard one of the women say when we come here and we are coming to do these things you guys sometimes you pretend like you've not seen us you don't even mind us today that people are coming to give us something there look at the energy and the yeah. excitement you guys are coming to take these things yeah. from today Obviously, the thing they came to share, some people will not get it. Mm. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. Sure. and others will get it. Yeah. From today, how do you think the reception will be for those who got it and those who did not get it? Moving forward. Yeah, I, I think it will be mixed. Uh, you will not so be sure because some will be thinking that uh, new one may come on. So let me put my all in. And some will be like, well, this is it. I don't think I have be. to push a hand because I am not part. So it will be a mixed thing. I mean, it can grow mm -hmm. because if others engage him, apart from him doing shutters thing, mm -hmm. if other musicians engage him, it means it's going to get bigger. Okay. And that one will convince others to also join. But yeah, for now, we can't say it that much, but I see more people trying to be part of it than not being part mm -hmm. of it. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. More people will join instead of shine away yeah, from it yeah. well Ro, yeah, quick one a, i also think it is 50 50. well mm -hmm. some of these things are personal uh, feelings that will push people to either join or not to join so i think it is early days yet to predict on whether it is going to go or decline but i think it is going to go looking at the demeanor in in the space i mean so many people were even surprised mm -hmm. even to the extent that one could, could buy say oh he's lost worse on the things like when he was giving the mic to say something i i can literally understand where his his feeling was coming from because this is something that he's or he said he's already done in a different market mm -hmm. that he did not get that reception okay. so coming to do it at the achimota market was a huge challenge for him to make it work by hook or crook and he were making it work means that the people that he's doing this for would show appreciation for the others that he's trying to convince them to join mm -hmm. to know that we are not doing it in vain mm. or our effort is going to pay off and that is it so now if he wants to go and do it even in a different market he has leverage now mm. he has a huge leverage and testimony to show that oh when i did this for abcd here they came to do this so there's the possibility a high possibility that when we also do this here and we grow that much they would come and also show appreciation because they are now my people so now he has a huge brand attached to his brand that okay. he can use as leverage to even preach more mm. and make it grow mm. Mm. well that is how beautiful it was earlier today at the achimota market and i want to say thanks to the market women once again being a part of the shutter movement empire team i want to say that we are grateful and we pray for more of such beautiful support from around the world let me say thanks to digital rasta currency for doing our camera for us richie flex editor and director of the show and to my panel members in team dodo solomon at the left uh, who is the online manager here at flex entertainment limited and to roland amate from roland reports shark z as well as shutter movement empire as well if you loved this uh, you have to subscribe to us because here we do more showbiz and again i also want to say thanks to you 
for following us. Tell someone about Sami Flex TV because this is the home of quality entertainment discussion. My name is Sami Flex. I'll see you when I see you. Happy Vows Day to all of us. We are out of here.